I was living a double life for a little over a year. I called my mom and I said, hey, mom, can I talk to you? She's like, yeah. I was like, are you sitting down? And I said, uh, I'm not religious anymore. She said, okay. Then she just hung up. And then we didn't speak for seven years. I looked in the mirror and I saw something that's not what I want to be. So I chose a different path. I don't know anything. I have to learn how people live. Google? What the hell is that? I couldn't Google how to Google because I didn't know how to Google in the first place. The more of a seeker you are, the more of a questioner you are, the more likely you are to leave. But they're designed a society where everybody who leaves, they end up in jail or in rehab. They never make it out there. I lived 12 years with a spouse who beat me, who yelled at me, who broke me, and I never responded. I just had more babies. I am breaking a religious law if I press charges. I can't do it anymore. If you don't show up in court, then you lose your children. For years we've been retreating and retreating. We can no longer retreat. Nobody leaves the Hasidic community unless they're willing to pay the price. 911, where is your emergency? There's people at the door banging down the door, and there's adult men outside, and I'm alone with the children. Do you know these people? They're my husband's family. 